back, guys. <coughs> finally, finally, finally. Found it. Found it. Finally. I don't give up, people. Finally found it on uh, my favorite retailer, West Coast Shaving. Never get no bullshit from them. Not product wise, but well, product and service wise, they've always been good to me. But I finally found it, guys. The full measure of man. So, get my ugly mug out of the uh, frame here. We'll get into this soap, guys. It's beautiful, pour as always. Excelsior base, beautiful tobacco scent. It's got vanilla, tobacco. It's got a lot of stuff in it. Geranium, maybe sandalwood. Got it whipped up here. Right there. If you, uh, it's called the White Horse. It's a box. I think it's a 20 mil. Got my uh, copper bowl. Copper bowl. Matches my copper earrings. Plugs, whatever the fuck you want to call them. Whipped up nicely right here. I'm going to just done wet the face. I'm just going to go straight to... I love horse brushes. I love a horse brush, but I don't love the fact that they tangle so badly. Like they tangle bad. Especially if you face lather, so. I will not be face lathering with a horse hair brush again. That's already looking better than not anyways by uh, bowl lathering. I load it off the puck, put the balloon water in the bowl, and uh, added water as needed to the brush and brought it back to the bowl. How you guys been? Me? Working like a slave. By the way, Jim, your package went out today. Wednesday, March 3rd. I suppose it'll be there in a week or so. Zachary, got your package the other day. Thank you very, very, very much, brother. Nick is just head over heels. And uh, he's very excited to try those blades and that Yaki Beast <coughs> head that you sent.
and those soap, uh, those uh, sticks of Arco as well. Razor. Seagull. Y'all ready for this? <laughs> Got the uh, Gillette Menorah, I guess. Super even on both sides. First use. No. Yeah, first use. First pass, let's go. I love this razor guys and I love these blades too. I got this razor for a steal on eBay. It's in pretty good condition to be as old as it is. I mean, damn near looks brand new besides the bottom. It's not toothless. It's got all of its teeth. Looks damn good in my opinion anyway. Um, I gave a whopping $14 shipped for it. He wanted like 20, but I, I really just didn't have it in the shave budget. And there was like only three other ones on eBay at the time. This was like two or three weeks ago. The only pain in the ass with this razor is making the blades, cutting the blades. I mean, it's not the safest thing in the world to do. <laughs> um, I don't have a template. I just eyeball it and I uh, trace the one that done the best. I uh, did no research on the scissors to get to cut the blades, but I don't know the name, they just say Italy. They're like cuticle. Did no research and uh, seen Douglas Smythe's post, how he bought like four or five sets of scissors and they're similar to these. So I'm glad I got the right ones on the first go. They work great if you have this razor and you want to know how to cut your blades. It's best if you have one of the original Seagull. Blades that you can trace straight off that blade, but I'm not paying $20 for a blade that sucks. I'm sure because all the older blades suck. And plus I'm just not going to pay $20 for one single blade. I'm just not going to do it. Even if it's the greatest blade in the world. But um, Douglas Smythe has a link on how to grow a mustache, I believe, of templates you can cut out. But I'm not going to fool with all that. I'll just eyeball it and trace. Eyeball and trace. Eyeball and trace. 
And I pretty much got it down to a science. It's like the fourth blade I've cut. Such a good razor. It really is. Nice first pass. Going in for the kill. On the last pass. white horse but anyway the scent is amazing it's like I smoked weed back in my youth when blunts first come out there was no wraps there was no backwoods it was go by Optimo or a honey or a, a Dutch master, or a white owl, go home, or wherever, bust it open, dump the tobacco, and put your poison in it, re-roll it, and this is what this reminds me of. Busting open a cigar. And I love it. And it's a seasonal. So I'm glad I got it. Uh, That sounds like something you would like. I'd advise you to pick it up as well. It's not going to be out forever. It's, it is a seasonal. I don't know if it's the end of winter seasonal or a beginning of spring. I'm not sure. All I know is smells great it's present I mean on a 1 to 10 scale and you guys know I like my stuff strong I'd give it every bit of a 7.5 every bit of it um, I'm going to go ahead and do a 3 pass so I'll go from ear to nose here just because I feel like shaving I don't have to, but I am. Um, all my new subscribers, thank you very much. I really do appreciate each and every one of you guys jumping on board. The people that have been here from the start, my very first subscribers. I hope I'm entertaining you. Are you entertained? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I dialed the soap in real nice. This will be the last bit of software for me for a while. I'm 
good long while. Got a lot of soaps to use. Stuff I haven't even used off camera yet. And I don't like to use soaps off camera. First, I like to use them on camera first. But I did use this on my head. I think, hell I can't remember. 20 minutes ago. Memory's terrible. The scent, I love the base. I'm so glad he did this in Excelsior. It's my favorite base. For Barrister and Man. Overall score for this soap, base, scent, and all. I give it every bit of a nine. Maybe a 9.5. No, I'll stick with a nine. That's base, that's scent, that's post, that's all of it, you know? It's a banger. I like it more than Vespers, personally. Not much, but it brings back memories for me, so that automatically makes it better. Vespers don't bring back any memories for me, personally. Um, that's just me. Scents are very subjective with strengths and how people perceive them um, but yeah Very cushiony, slick. I mean, you can't really get any much better, if any, in my opinion. bathroom smells like this awesome tobacco bro. 
brush out of the sink. Think about those skinny brushes, they don't like the stand at all. have a new razor I've purchased. Shock, shock. That's why my uh, shaving budget is done. It's not a super expensive razor. I mean, it's not cheap. It's not super expensive. But I bought the soap and the balm and shipping and other shit and shit just adds up you know I'm sure most of you guys can relate that don't have super disposable income I'm lucky super lucky to have what I have uh, Shut up, you damn toilet. Motherfucker well, pisses me off. Goatee's coming out nice. Very nice. Towel, Mr. Towel. <coughs> right, Mr. Comb. Caveman comb. Yeah, guys, I apologize that everything's backwards. Um, the app I'm using, I like a lot. It shows me my battery life. It shows me a pause button. It shows me a lot of options I can use. Everything but a uh, mirror. So I really apologize, but it's the only way 
I can stop or stop the video, pause the video. I can't do that. I can flip it and keep recording if I needed. So this is what I use. And plus I have these little uh, gimmicks down here that I, I like to put. Can't do any of that with a uh, Apple Apple uh, video. So I apologize, guys, about the uh, the forked up uh, flip. I'm sorry. Uh, you just have to deal with it. Maybe the guys that made the Apple update that. Paid five dollars for the app to take the damn ads off. That shit was pissing me off. But anyway, it is what it is. It isn't what it isn't. Going in, gotta know I got the matching. Balm. Aftershave Balm, the full measure of man with Jehovah and hydraulic acid. I was waiting on that comment. If it didn't say hydraulic acid, it'd burn your face off. That's something acid, damn it. Oh my god, under the nose. Whoo, I got close there. Got close everywhere, but so what that looks like. If anybody cares, Barrister Man makes a very good balm. I like it. Matches the scent perfectly, in my opinion. like a million dollars and look like 50 cent 25 cent I don't look like 50 cent he's African American I look like 25 cent alright recap ladies and gentlemen via long white horse With a little uh, PAA silicone band on it to give it a little more backbone I like the brush I really do copper bowl hand punched got it on eBay it's like seven pounds came from uh, London apparently uh, the sickle the sickle Seagal, that mechanism trips me out, man, that's trippy, man. But no. Nah. Very nice razor, if you can find one, under 20 bucks, 20 bucks. I think I got lucky with this condition. At that price, I did counter offer him. Don't forget, guys, you can counter offer. And they may say, and they may say, I. Right. That's just a chance you got to take. You don't know how hard up they are for money. And lately, I mean, in past days when I was buying a bunch of. Uh, now, if it's only one, I'd go ahead and jump on it. If you had the money, but you know what I mean? You gotta do what you gotta do. Just don't forget you can counter off for those guys. And gals on there. So that's the brush, that's the soap, that's the razor, that's the lid and the floor. I cap my soap right after my video or my shave 
but I do keep it upside down on a towel, half on a towel, half getting air on the side of my sink while I'm shaving. And uh, that's the bowl, that's the brush, that's the razor, that's the blade, that's me. And that was my shave. Um, like I said, I appreciate all my subscribers and I noticed I got about seven or eight new subscribers lately. I don't know how. I guess y'all just stumbled across me. But here, we do what we can. We keep it real. We don't fabricate shit. We, uh, we keep it real, man. It's just a real, real dude, real shaving. Um, got any questions, drop them in the comments below. Like I said, Zachary, I appreciate that. And, uh, Sean, uh, that shit should be coming through the fucking, uh, across the border soon, whatever. Baggage check shit type shit next week. So that and Jim, shit's on the way. Be on the lookout. Check your mail. Should be there. We'll see. Uh, I got the mail down to a T, so it should be there no later than Monday or Tuesday. So when I get the, uh, when I get the uh, tracking, I'll send it to you via Facebook message. Look at this goatee, guys. Look at this thing. <laughs> See? Pretty nice, eh? Anyways, it's been six to eight shaves. Another great shave in the books. God, I love that scent. Glad I finally got it, but we're getting up on 33 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and hop off here. I'll catch you guys probably tomorrow with a head shave. I know half of you, most of y'all don't like that, but now you can hear that. I need a head shave, guys. So, I'll be putting one up. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow sometime. Stay sharp. Peace.